Okay, calculate the binding energy in Joule of a deuterium nucleus. The mass of deuterium nucleus is uh, this one lah, in kilogram. Okay, the mass of neutron and mass of proton all given in kilogram. Okay, that's good. So this time, pay attention, the unit is in kilogram. Ah, not atomic mass unit, yeah, or in SI unit. And he wants, the question wants the binding energy. Okay. In Joule. Uh, so, all you can see, all in uh, SI unit lah. All in SI unit. Okay. All in SI unit. Deuterium. Uh, what is exact, what is actually a deuterium nucleus? Yeah, what is actually deuterium? Deuterium is H2. Yeah. Deuterium actually is uh, H2. Uh, 2, 1 uh, It's hydrogen 2 Hydrogen 2 atom yeah? Hydrogen uh, 2 uh, Isotope yeah? Hydrogen 2 atom uh, Hydrogen 2 okay? Because we have you know, We have um, We have Proton uh, Or we call it pron, Sometimes we call it Prontium Yeah Prontium, proton, prontium. We have uh, uh, deuteron, deuteron, or we call deu, deute, deuterium. Okay, I don't know why there is difference in the spelling. Uh, and then we have tritium. We have uh, tritium. Uh, so what's the difference? The difference is uh, proton is uh, hydrogen 1. Yeah, hydrogen 1. Uh, this one is hydrogen 2. This one is hydrogen 3. Uh, the way to write it is uh, hydrogen 1 is hydrogen 1 is a proton. Yeah, hydrogen 1. Hydrogen uh, uh, hydrogen 1 is uh, this one hydrogen 1 1. Uh, hydrogen 1 1 is a proton, just a proton. This one, hydrogen deuterium, is uh, hydrogen 2, 1. Hydrogen 2, 1. Understand? Uh, hydrogen 2, 1. Uh, let's look at uh, Alright. Hydrogen 2, 1. And then tritium is hydrogen 3, 1. Uh, understand? Protium. Uh, actually, mass of, new, mass of deuterium nucleus, mass of new, deuterium nucleus, you also can find from the list of constant. You understand? You can find this deuterium in the list of constant. Only the tritium not in the list of constant. See that this one? Ah, see here, deuteron mass. Deuteron mass is three point three four exponent negative twenty seven. Is it the same as the given? Yeah, deuterium is three point three four exponent negative twenty seven. Yeah, kilogram is the same. Yeah, only this one is a uh, round up value. Deuteron is three point three four exponent negative twenty seven kilogram. 3.34 exponent negative 27 kilogram. Yeah. So in the list of list of constant, you also can find list of constant. You also can find the deuterium mass. Yeah, mass of deuterium. Ah, uh, the H21. Yeah, the hydrogen two, hydrogen two. Yeah. Uh, either in kilogram or atomic mass unit. Also, you have. Yeah. You can find the electron mass, neutron mass, proton mass, deuterium mass. Ah, uh, deuterium mass. Also, you have. Okay, in the list of constant. Okay, so if the question here doesn't provide you this deuterium, deuterium mass, uh, this, this mass actually you can find from the list of constant. Uh, okay, you can find from the list of constant, the deuterium mass. Okay, uh, so it's not necessarily this value yeah, to be provided. You can find from the list of constant. The mass of neutron and mass of proton also can find from the list of constant. Okay? But if the question already provide you, then you must use the values given here. Yeah? Uh, if we already provide you the value here, you must use the values here. You cannot use the values in the list of constant. Understand? Don't use the value in the list of constant. Use the values given. Okay? If the question gives you the, the value, I must use the value here. Okay? Uh, if not provided this value, then only you use the values from list of constant. Okay, the deuteron, neutron, and proton. Okay, good. So now, uh, go back to this deuteron. Deuteron is, you know, uh, got 
one hydrogen and one uh, one neutron and one proton okay uh, this one hydrogen two one actually is one proton uh, is actually one proton plus one neutron uh, one neutron uh, one proton plus one neutron yeah proton number is one mass number is two so two minus one you get one neutron uh, one neutron okay so write the equation the equation is uh, one proton plus one neutron one neutron you get uh, hydrogen deuterium h21 or you can also write it as uh, one proton hydrogen one one plus one neutron hydrogen uh, one zero uh, get a deuterium uh, so you can write either way lah you want to write uh, the top simpler one you want to write this simpler one or you want to write more elaborate one also can yeah so it's, uh, you see one plus one you get two one plus zero you get one uh, okay so all uh, all this these are all the nucleons uh, these are all the nucleons combine you get the nucleus understand these are all the individual uh, nucleons proton and neutron are the nucleons yeah F combine them forming the nucleus deuterium okay so first of all to find the binding energy we need to find the mass defect so mass defect is delta m uh, delta m so we take the total proton uh, total nucleons yeah uh, the, this is the formula uh, okay minus the nucleus uh, minus the nucleus this is actually uh, all the nucleons combined minus the nucleus understand uh, minus the nucleus mass of all nucleons minus the mass of nucleus uh, so that's the formula lah that's the formula mass of uh, the proton plus neutron minus the mass of nucleus okay so okay let's calculate continue yeah continue so proton how many proton you have one proton uh, mass of one proton mass of proton is 1.67 uh, uh, that's the value provided uh, exponent negative 27 kilogram and then plus uh, one neutron one neutron one mass of neutron uh, 1.67 exponent negative 27 kilogram uh, okay and then minus the nucleus of minus the nucleus of deuterium which is 3.344 275 so exponent negative 27 ah uh, okay uh, this one also in kilogram uh, make sure all in kilogram ah. Uh. Make sure all in kilogram or all in U atomic mass unit U U U. Kilogram, kilogram, kilogram. Uh, don't mix up, yeah. And okay, let's calculate. Let's calculate what we what do we get? 1.672648 exponent negative 27 plus 1.67 4954 uh exponent negative 27 and then minus the 3.344 275 75 exponent negative 27 negative 27 okay so i got the answer is um 3.327 3.327 exponent negative 30 negative 30 kilogram ah i got the answer the mass defect the mass defect okay so mass defect in kilogram now i want to find the in joule the unit 
joule. Uh, I want the unit in joule. See that? So uh, I need to use a formula. I need to use a formula uh, binding energy. Binding energy equal to delta m c square. Uh, delta m c square. So be careful with this. This one to use this formula. To use this formula, the delta m need to be in kilogram. Yeah, and the binding energy you get in joule. Uh, you cannot uh, say uh, m. This one is mev. This one also u cannot. Yeah, cannot. Ah, uh, this the the delta m cannot be in u. The binding energy cannot be MeV. Uh, cannot be MeV. Uh, this one all must be in SI unit only. Uh, SI unit only. Okay. The delta M, delta M need to be in kilogram. Kilogram. Binding energy you get in joule. Uh, you get in joule. The uh, only SI unit. Okay. So now already get the unit, the delta M already in kilogram, uh, already in kilogram. So you can directly uh, substitute this kilogram mass into delta M. Then you can get the binding energy in joule, uh, get the answer straight away. So delta M is uh, 3.327 exponent negative 30 kilogram. And then uh, speed of light is 3 exponent 8. Uh, speed of light you can find from the list of constant. Lah. Speed of light C you can find from the list of constant. 3 exponent 8. You see that? You uh, can find from the list of constant. And then don't forget the MC square. You have a square there. Huh? I mean, you shouldn't forget about the square. Okay, and then okay, calculate. Yeah, 3 exponent 8 square. 3 exponent 8 square. Uh, three point three two seven exponent negative thirty. Uh, multiply three exponent eight square. So I got answer is um. The answer I got is uh two point nine nine, two point nine nine four three, and uh, two point nine nine four three exponent negative thirteen joule. Ah, uh, that's the answer. Okay, uh, that's the answer uh, in joule, the, 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 the binding energy. Uh, okay, so it's 2.99, 2.9943, yeah, 2.9943 exponent negative 13 joule, uh, unit in joule. Okay, so that's, that's the answer, yeah. Uh, so deuterium is made of one proton and one neutron. Uh, the formula deuterium you must know is H21. Okay, it's one proton plus one uh, neutron. Uh, so if you look at uh, those uh, hydrogen isotopes we have, like proton, prontium, uh, actually it's made of, this one is made of one proton, one proton plus zero neutron. Yes, it doesn't have neutron. If deuterium, deuteron, deuteron is made of one proton plus one neutron. Understand? One proton plus one neutron. If tritium is also one proton plus two neutron, uh, because it's mass number three minus one, you get two neutron. So you have the same proton number, same atomic number, different neutron number, different mass number. So this is called isotopes. Okay. Same chemical property but uh, different uh, physical property. So these are all uh, isotopes. Isotopes of uh, hydrogen. Uh, isotopes of uh, hydro, um, hydrogen atom. Okay. These are all isotopes of hydrogen. Different mass number but same proton number. See that? Same proton number. Uh, okay, same proton number. Okay, so that's all for these questions. I hope you understand. Uh, proton, de deuterium, and tritium. Yeah. Okay, so that's all. Okay, bye.